Random Hub Sports TV. I want to thank all the subscribers, all you all that continue on supporting this channel. You guys are awesome, You're wonderful. You guys are just, I can't do it without you. Uh, the announcement just came out. Carmelo Anthony has retired from the NBA. One of my favorite players, one of my all-time favorite players, one of the greatest scorers we've ever seen. A guy who just represents the game well, who wasn't always respected by everyone. And, um, for some reason, the league treated him some kind of way. They kind of blackballed him and played games with him, which I felt like was unfair. Um, and then you got people to point the finger and say he never won a championship. But I, you know, I bet, I mean, he, he did win a championship, but you got to look at the whole narrative, though. Why he never won a championship? Because he wasn't always put in the best position to win. And I believe the teams were manipulated. Uh, he, he was blocked, the black ball from getting on teams that could have put him in a position to, to win and compete. Uh, namely, one of the, the, the ones I'm thinking about is Houston. The first time you want to go to Houston Rockets, uh, and then you had guys like James Harden and guys trying to keep him off the team, and they were jealous because James Harden cared more about numbers than he did about actually helping a guy, you know, helping uh, actually winning the winning the championship, winning the games. And, uh, and if you put a your teammate in the best position to win, if they play better than good, if, they, if you win, then everybody wins. Uh, but you know, James Harden, we all know, he knows what's know. We know what time it is with that guy. We know what he's all about. Uh, and it's just unfortunate. Carmelo just got in some bad situations. Billy Donovan in Oklahoma City didn't want to start him, put him on the bench. And, you know, just, and, and the thing about it is he, he played his role. He did what was best for the team. You know, uh, Phil Jackson in New York, just a lot of just unfortunate things that were done to him throughout the course of his career. Uh, but I, I watched Tickets video about it. And, you know, he was so great in detail. Like, he, he pretty much he pretty much said everything he's been saying. But uh, I salute Carmelo Anthony, one of my favorite players. I wish him the best in his retirement. I, I still wish that he would. I wish the Lakers would have brought him back. Uh, you know, but that's kind of what happens when you put all your money in LeBron James and Anthony Davis. That's a whole other uh, discussion there. Uh, but Carmelo Anthony, man, we're going to miss you the game. We're going to miss Carmelo Anthony. There's some players, when they're gone, you miss them. And he is an example of a guy. Now that he's gone, he will be sadly missed, not in a way he died, but uh, in a way that you will know, not ever see another guy like him again. Uh, all right, Brandon Love Sports TV, I am out.